Usually one of the quietest months of the year, the market has been buzzing since June. So has this November been any different? Talk around the estate agency community is that November has been a really quiet month. So how did the M44 area perform? Well, I have to say I felt things have really quietened down myself. So has that affected the stats? Let's see. In 2019, there were 31 new houses put onto the market. This year, it was down to 20, so a drop of 11. So a really quiet month for people doing going live on the market. Are people still moving though? And luckily, the answer is yes. There were 30 sales agreed this month in M44, compare it, compared to just 19 in 2019. So an increase. So it's a mixed bag really, sales up in November, but listings down. For those that are interested, the breakdown of types of houses sold are on the screen now for you to have a quick look at. A lot of people wait until after Christmas to put their home onto the market, get the festivities out the way and launch in January. So it's relatively a busy month in January, but believe it or not, you are missing a trick. At Oliver James, we run every year a very successful Do Not Disturb campaign over Christmas. And last year, Rightmove saw a 230% increase between Christmas and New Year in inquiries and views online. So what we do is launch your property on Christmas Eve, collect all the extra inquiries, and we do not disturb you over Christmas, because I'm sure the last thing you want is me knocking on your door on Christmas Day showing people around. So what we do is we collect all the inquiries and we give you a call in January with some buyers. Last year we sold 80% of our stock within the first few weeks of January. There is a link to a video in the description above with more info if you are interested in that. Thank you everyone for watching and from everyone at Oliver James and from my family Laura, Amber and Melody, may we wish you all a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. And I'll see you at the end of the year or the beginning of the next year, 2021, for our end of year review. Keep well. Speak soon.